As a lifelong hunter, it's always been a dream of mine to harvest a whitetail in full velvet. The state of Tennessee has so much to offer you. Whether you love country music, you're a big sports fan, or you just love the great outdoors, there's probably something there for you to enjoy. But the reason why I'm going to Tennessee, they offer an early season velvet hunt. And I just knew this would be my best opportunity to turn my dreams into a reality. What's up everybody? Uh, we just got into Tennessee. I'm with my family and my boys and the puppy of course here, um, headed over to the property that I have access to. We're gonna set out some mineral sites and put some cameras up. It's August the 18th. Uh, so the Tennessee velvet hunt is about a week away and I cannot wait. I'm excited. This is my first time to hunt Tennessee velvet. Um, so looking forward to that. And uh, we're uh, gonna go see what we can see. This will be my first time laying eyes on the property. So looking forward to it. I just got to the property this morning. Already seen several deer running around through here. I'm about to go uh, check out a spot that I've marked on the uh, Spartan Forge app and uh, see if, what it looks like. So uh, I don't know what we're gonna see here. Uh, this looks like a very promising spot. I may have hit a gold mine uh, as far as getting permission spot here in Tennessee. So uh, one buck this morning already looked like a four point and um, a couple does crossing through. So, so far so good. We're gonna go see what this spot looks like. Just left the property here in Tennessee. I got a couple cameras out, set some mineral sites up, picked a few stand locations. I'm gonna watch the cameras all week and let that dictate where I hunt. Uh, there was plenty of deer out there today, as you can see. And so looking forward to getting back up here and getting in the tree. Uh, it's gonna be an awesome weekend. Can't wait to get back up here in Tennessee for the velvet hunt. Picking right back up where I left you guys in the car. Uh, but just a week later, it's Thursday, August 24th. I got the car loaded down with all of my equipment. Um, headed up to the property, gonna go straight there. Probably got about another hour and a half. About to cross the state line into Tennessee and looking forward to this weekend. It's finally here. This is my first velvet hunt. And uh, so super excited. I got a few stand spots picked out. Uh, I'm gonna go straight in there and hang those and look forward to tomorrow. We'll see you in the morning, bright and early. Well, it's finally here. Deer season 23 has just been kicked off. Already had a great morning. Uh, six does came through about six o'clock this morning. Um, awesome way to start this Tennessee velvet hunt. The mosquitoes are terrible and they're expecting highs in the um, up to 100 today. I don't know how long I'm going to sit through that. We're just going to see. Uh, hopefully we got a nice buck come through here. It's day two. Here in Tennessee we got a uh, pretty big storm system rolling in. Uh, I had to sit in the car and let the bulk of it pass. But i um, going to try to slip in here on a break and uh, get set up and see if something comes in right after this rain stops. So anyway, got a little good ways to walk. So I'm going to slip in here and see what happens. Last morning, Tennessee Velvet. Had a shooter show up last night, so I'm gonna sit all day in this spot. I'm supposed to have storms coming in and out throughout the day. Got a cold front, the high is only 79 today. Yesterday it was 100. So I'm optimistic that these deer are gonna be up on their feet most of the day with this front that's come in. So we'll see what happens.
smoked him. Smoked him, baby. Go down. Go down. Go down. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Smoked him. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, he came in perfect and then he went behind me. I don't even know what in the world just happened. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Oh, this tree was in the way. I was not prepared to shoot that way. Oh my gosh. Yes. Let's go. Oh. Thank you, Jesus. Oh. I got to I gotta call my wife. Oh man. That deer came in here last night. He hit on the camera right when this front was about to push through. We got another front about to push through and he come in again. Boom. Oh Lord, thank you Jesus. I haven't watched the shot back yet, but I mean, I could see it looked like it hit him good. He's quartered away just a little bit. As he was going off, he had a, uh, I could see where I hit. It looked like it was a good, looked like it was a good shot. Oh, I gotta settle my nerves before I fall out of this tree. I didn't even know if I was gonna be able to shoot my bow Last week on Monday, I was cutting a tree at my farm back in Alabama, cutting a tree down out of a trail, and I had a branch fall on my shoulder. I went to the ER, no broken bones, but man, I have been sore for a week. I've been icing nonstop, taking ibuprofen around the clock pretty much, and oh my gosh, that's the first time I've drawn my bow back since, since that happened. I guess adrenaline got me going so oh lord thank you jesus thank you jesus tennessee velvet baby tennessee velvet that's my first velvet buck ever it's been a dream of mine and i think i can check that off the list i'm not going to get too excited until i get my hands on him but man what a pretty deer what a pretty deer All right, I just got down. Um, it stands right over here behind me, up here in this tree right there. Right there. Anyway, he was standing right here, already got good blood. Right here at the uh, shot site. Rewatched the footage, it looked good. Uh, can't find my arrow anywhere on the ground right here, but uh, I'm not too concerned about that uh, right this second. So we're gonna take up this blood trail and see what we can see. Got good blood here. Yeah, just found my arrow. Looks like a double lung for sure. So we're gonna keep pressing on this blood trail. Blood here, blood here. Blood right here. Blood right here. There he is, baby. There he is. Let's go. Woo! This is a good deer. This is a good deer. Yes, sir. Oh my goodness. What a stud. Oh, he's done. He's done. Oh. Oh. Yes, 
out here. Ooh, boy. Look at that right there. Old Tennessee velvet buck. Man, that thing is pretty. Let's go. I'm gonna get to dragging him out. I ain't got far to go now since he ran towards the truck. Yes, yeah, sir. Man, what an incredible morning. This deer showed up last night on camera. I put together a game plan late last night. Slipped in here this morning, around 10.30, he came walking down the trail. He was on last night. Couldn't have asked for a better hunt. And uh, man, Tennessee did not disappoint. This is exactly what you want to come here for. And uh, feel that tag. Oh, I'm so grateful, thank you, Jesus. I love hunting. I love everything about it. Just so grateful. And uh, I can't wait to get back in the woods in October, back in, at home in Alabama and uh, do this again so thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe revive outdoors hopefully we got so much more content coming for you guys this season and uh as always take a child hunting or fishing so they too can enjoy the outdoors thanks for watching tennessee out